And in Pinellas Park, a woman shot outside of her workplace last week has died. Police say the man responsible is her husband. Officers killed him after a tense standoff there, and now the couple's family tells Grady Trimble they did not see any warning signs. I'm still in shock. Everybody in our family is in shock. The last time Faye Robertson talked to her daughter, they were making Easter weekend plans. Now she's planning to bury her this weekend. I'm angry and I'm hurt why he would do that to my daughter and do it to himself when he has two boys that love him. Police say David Whitman went to his wife Anna's workplace last week, took her outside and shot her. He ran to his house where police say they had no choice but to kill him after an hours long standoff. Anna Whitman's sister says she never imagined the high school sweetheart's marriage ending like this. I never thought that he was capable of something like this. She says Whitman told her husband she needed a break after already trying couples therapy, but she never saw any serious warning signs. No signs of abuse in no way at all. Now both David and Anna Whitman are gone. Their family left filling in the blanks to questions they'll never get answered. The only thing I could think of is he just didn't want to live without her. He loved her so much he didn't want to live without her. And that family spent the last week in the hospital with Anna Whitman. She was in critical condition and was not getting any better. Her two adult children tell us they are planning services for Saturday.